and welcome back to Good Neighbors. As we get ready to close out the program, we've been talking to Mrs. Carla Bolin, who is the VP of Marketing for the Chamber of Commerce for the city of Wichita Falls, Texas. And we are glad to have her on. Of course, uh, we've known each other through the years and um, the things that she has done to help not propel only students, but as well as the city has been awesome. Now, as you get ready, we get ready to close out the program. We talked about, you know, just we just hit snippets of what the chamber does, but I want to hear what it, what are the future things for the chamber or for uh, Pride in the Falls? Pride in the Falls is about halfway finished with its three-year contract, and what we're looking at next, which is going to be a huge undertaking, is to try to redesign and reproduce a lot of our signage in the city. That sounds like a huge job, but if you're not from Wichita Falls and you've tried to drive through here and find some place, it's very difficult. We want to make it more user-friendly. Mm -hmm. We want our, for example, our nice bike trail, hiking and bike trail. It needs some signage. Mm -hmm. We have uh, old wooden planks that, uh, that show us where our parks are. We would like to change that. We would like to have kiosks downtown where you can stop and say, oh, well, this is a restaurant right down here we can go to. So we do need to improve our signage, and it's, it's hard to get the money to do that. So that's the first thing we're going to be working on. The second thing is the member websites. We want to get the four entities' websites tied together. So if I search for something, for example, and it's something about a convention, mm -hmm. They may have searched me by mistake, but it'll flip over to the Convention and Visitors Bureau so that they can answer it. So there's a lot of World Wide Web that we're working on. And I on. think that's, that's very important in being user-friendly because you have a lot of uh, individuals getting on. I mean, isn't your, your parents are on. Oh, they've always been on. You know, they were so, online before I was. And it's like, okay, well, all right. You know. Well, and, and also people look at Wichita Falls through that web glass. Mm -hmm. any, any business that starts to come here, the first thing they do is Google it to see what we're like. Mm -hmm. And so we want to control that picture. And that's awesome, and, and making sure our picture is uh, identifiable yes. to not just our community, but to the world. Yes. So when they see us, they're like, oh, yeah, I remember that place. And it was a good time. There are good things. And I'm, I'm going to have to go back there. Mm -hmm. Now, with the signage, I think that is awesome in making sure that they're um, uh, appropriate for every aspect of the city. Now, if someone, as we get ready to close, if someone has an idea, can they send it to the chamber and go, you know what, why don't y'all do this? Or why, you know? You know, I, and I get those sometimes. Okay. And there's, mm, some of them are very, very good ideas. We have a site called choosewichitafalls.com. And on it, it says, you want to contact us and say something? And I get them all the time, and many of them are very good. So, Great. yes, absolutely, we always want ideas. Well, that is awesome. And it's awesome to be sitting here with you, madam, interviewing you or just talking. And we could have talked all day. We could have talked about shoes. We could have talked about purses. But you know what? We're going to conduct ourselves decent and in order. And I appreciate you taking time out of your schedule to come on the program. Well, thank you, sweetheart. You're welcome, madam. And we thank you for being here on Good Neighbors, finding out about your community, how you can be of assistance, Make sure that you go onto the website and find out what is going on as well as help get the news out to be proud of Wichita Falls and as well as support our troops first. Thank you for tuning in to Good Neighbors. Until next time, we'll see you right here.